Good evening everyone and welcome to a new vlog. Something a little bit exciting, this is new to Tenerife as well. We're on the way, I'm just at Siam Mall. I wanted to start off here while it was still light because where we were going is gonna be particularly dark but in a good way and for a good reason. Uh, we are off to the brand new Chinese Lantern World which only opened, I'd say a couple of months ago. Uh, we've been waiting to go and we've got the perfect opportunity tonight to uh, go with Seb and Christy from The Incredible Wilsons. We're gonna take Seb along, Laura's coming as well. I'm gonna show you everything. I'll let you know the prices. Uh, we have booked it online. There is currently an Easter weekend discount of 30%. So if you're here in Tenerife at the moment, if you're here over Easter, check out their website. There is an Easter discount code. There is also a discount code for residents as well. So we've got resident discount and Easter discount as well tonight. Uh, so I'm gonna show you absolutely everything. They've got parking there. It's just before you get up to the main Adeki village, just as you come off the motorway on the right-hand side. They've got a restaurant there, all kinds of different things going on. So I'm gonna take you along, show you everything. I think this is gonna be a good one for the kids in particular. So uh, let's uh, stride on. Okay, so we have just arrived. It is free to park. You just pull in from the main road there. You've got a gentleman directing everyone in. You park on here for free. And then you've got the ticket sales office here. So Seb and Christy are just gonna buy their tickets. We've bought ours online. It's open nightly from 8 p.m. until 11.30. I do believe there's a restaurant inside, etc. We'll see what is going on. There's a few rides as well going on. Beautiful sunset tonight, I will add. But yeah, we bought our tickets online. As I said, there is a Samana Santa discount code. I'll leave it on the screen. If you're here over Easter, you can save 30%. So I imagine that's why it looks a little bit busier tonight uh, from when I've driven past it a couple of times. But loads of traditional different sculptures. You can see all different animals from around the world. It is all thought out and themed. So I'm looking forward to getting in now. But yeah, if you haven't got tickets or you didn't buy them online, don't worry, you can come to the uh, ticket office here and get them here or just buy them online. Uh, you do get sent the ticket straight to your email address, nice and easy. So you'll notice I have brought my uh, hoodie. Laura's got her little jumper on as well. I would recommend just bringing a hoodie with you, a couple of jackets. It does go a little bit cooler at night time, especially on a slightly cloudy day like this. So bring a jumper just in case, it does go a little bit cooler. So it does look very nice already. It's not quite gone fully dark yet. We've got here, uh, it's about half past eight. It's not fully dark yet, but seeing the sunset and then they're going to start coming brighter and brighter as it goes dark. Zeb, excited? Yeah. Nervous? No. But there's a big dragon in there that's definitely going to come after you. That'll eat you after. Well, not yeah, after he's... Yeah, yeah, I'll bring you in with me. To show you, they have got a full map. This is where we're coming in here and it does loop all the way around. You've got the restaurant in the middle, which looks nice. And as you can see, all different themings. This is the big massive dragon, which is a main feature. Sea life. So it is quite big. Walk all the way around. We'll, uh, we'll jump in. So I do just want to shout out again, uh, Brevity for the fantastic backpack. Uh, they do have a night strata discount code we absolutely love this again it is filled with all kinds tonight i've got my gimbal i've got my jumper i've got my spare filming equipment etc all inside lifetime warranty with it as well absolutely love it i will leave the link to that in the description if you want to check it out it's just perfect for carrying around on nights like this where we need to have spare equipment and battery packs etc but it's starting to really get lit up nice here now as the sun goes down. Uh, loads of little rides for the kids. We've got this where you jump on them and the, the colour changes on the lights. And this big tent here in the middle is a restaurant. Going to take a little look inside. It looks fantastic. And then we've got some food being cooked out here. This must be the kitchen for the restaurant. Fantastic little setup. And then you've got nice traditional Chinese music on in the background. What do you think, Laura? nice isn't it something different yeah. something very different oh i might have i'll be having some of that later a bit of waffles but it's also educational as well as you go around you do learn different things in from you know chinese tradition basically as you go around all the signs for each little section yeah all good so far 
So as you go around, there is information. So this is all about the Warriors and the Great Wall, uh, also known as the Great Wall with 10,000 miles long. So there is loads of information about what you're looking at as well on each section. It is starting to go dark now. It's starting to look really nice. So we'll just take a quick peek inside the restaurant. We're not eating here tonight, but I will have a little look what it's like inside. I can already see it looks very interesting in here. It's much bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Wow, that is fantastic. How different is it in here? Wow, looks absolutely, it smells amazing as well, actually. You can actually smell a lot of the plants. That is a lovely, that's miles better than I thought it was gonna be. It's stunning in here. How stunning is it in here? You've got an old like classic piano and things. Wow. When they said cozy restaurant, there is a radio advert. They said cozy restaurant, but I did not think it was gonna be like this. It's stunning. I will try and find the menu so I can show you what sort of food they've got. But, and it is actually, when they say cozy, it's nice and warm actually. It is, lovely and warm. Yeah, we, yeah, oh yeah, cocktails, they do coffees as well. But yeah, we'll try and find a menu so I can show you what they've got on uh, on offer. So just to mention as well, if you are planning on coming, there is an aerobatic show um, at half past 10. And then there is also another show uh, at half past nine. So there is extra little things that go on outside. So do bear that in mind. Make sure you get here for these two. Even the theming behind the bar. I love it. Absolutely love it. I think it's fantastic. Okay, so Laura's found the menu. We've got dragon's ribs, pork tenderloin, chicken breast, vegan, chicken salad. So it's quite simple, but I imagine it's, I bet you it's full of flavor. I bet you it is really nice. I can yeah. see them cooking it outside on the barbecue. Yeah. Then drinks wise, you've got soft drinks. And then there is a cocktail menu, is there, I imagine? Alcohol. Definitely alcohol going on. I just wanted to show this. I think that is so cool. This is an old classic football TV. Let me know in the comments, have you ever seen anything like this before? I genuinely haven't, but it looks, I bet you back in the day that was really cool to have. It's still cool now. I think that's fantastic. I don't want to touch it. That is amazing. Love that. But there's just loads of different little artifacts and different interesting bits all around. I just thought that little TV was so cool. <laughs> Even Laura spotted that little football TV. Let me know your thoughts on that in the comments. Boss, that isn't it? Yeah, really good. And yeah, as we come out, it is getting darker and darker. Really nice. So you've got oh, a nice uh, Statue of Liberty there from New York. And then you've got, this is all your ice sculpture features, Antarctica, yeah. They've got some great photo opportunities as well, like this one here, Seb's getting a lovely picture there with the lantern in the background, bit of a sunset. There's definitely some lovely picture opportunities set up around as well. Uh, the lights do seem to flicker a little bit on the camera. That's just the way it is, unfortunately, with the uh, iPhones. But now I'm looking forward to a little drink in that restaurant. Thank you. 
so far I think it's absolutely excellent it will be a little bit of a flicker unfortunately when we film it but the lights are all fantastic I'm going to insert some pictures actually just to try and show it as clear as it is it's never going to come out as good as it is in person but the atmosphere is lovely just a nice soft Chinese music very traditional lovely evening definitely bring a little jacket but it's lovely don't have to wear any masks out outdoors at the moment that will all change soon anyway but I'm gonna wear any masks wandering around plenty of space it's all spaced out nice it's, I've got to say <clears throat> I'm impressed and I love that restaurant we're heading in there for a little drink in a minute Seb's loving it with the swings I would definitely say as I mentioned at the start definitely one for the kids this one 100% if your kids love Christmas lights come and do this because they really will enjoy it it's something very very different do you think then Seb would you recommend it yeah what do you think should I, should I go on that with uh, with Seb yeah, <laughs> absolutely. are you coming on it we all going on it we're all on it if I can vlog it I will vlog it guys <laughs> so just to mention we are going on this it's two euros each if you want to do the little pirate ship here we're going for it we'll be uh, good no, fun no I, I don't think Andrew should go on it I think he why not? I think you'll scream a bit too much. I might be deaf after well, this, you never know. I won't scream as much as your dad though. <laughs> Thank you. So, everyone's laughing at me here. I'm, I'll show you my situation in a minute. You ready? Are we ready to go? <laughs> Let me show you what I look like. Whoa. I'm right in the back in the cage here. Whoa. Oh. 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 Whoa. 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 Oh no. No, no, no. It's worse when you film me. I can't take my hand off. Just a bit. I'm t I can't take my hand off to change the angle. <laughs> Whoa. So we just took a seat, Laura, the girls have gone for some nice copper bags. You're just saying the theming in here is lovely, isn't it? So nice. So different. Yeah, really helpful, all dressed up nice as well. Nice and themed. But I do, it is really cosy in here. Oh, and I've got some brownies as well. I couldn't help myself, I've gone for a little brownie. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, this looks nice. Very nice.
So it is great fun for kids this bit, isn't it? They're all absolutely loving the polar bear. His little bit, his little nose moves, and they're all absolutely loving him for the kids. Really good fun. The acrobatics before it were fantastic as well. They did a good flame throw and everything. Just the kids this bit, absolutely loving the polar bear. Absolutely loving him. So we've got a bit of Gangnam style going on here now. <laughs> Quality. We've got the panda and the polar bear going mad here. <laughs> Walk on Gangnam style. Did you enjoy that dancing? Yeah. Bit of Gangnam style? Yeah. Which was your favourite, panda or polar bear? Polar bear, because it is what like. And the nose, you see the nose moving? Yeah, it was like <laughs> there is a whole another level down here with all the animals on it does go on for quite a while it is quite big but it it's not going to come out on camera just how nice it is all the colors and everything with it being dark now it is difficult to film things like this you've got a gorgeous big light up peacock, peacock with easter eggs all around up here really is for kids amazing you've seen Seb they absolutely loved it up there on stage doing the dancing really really good fun i love the restaurant as well if you choose probably what we should have done is chosen to eat in here i did have that brownie was gorgeous but the food that was coming out the chicken breast and everything in there looked amazing and i just loved the theming inside uh, so i probably would recommend saving it and saving dinner and, and eating here i really didn't think it was going to be a restaurant like that that well themed really good So that is going to be it from here, Chinese Lantern World, absolutely fantastic. Uh, two recommendations, make sure you bring a jumper in case it, case it goes chilly. Uh, the other thing is, I wouldn't wear your best, best shoes, it is very dusty, very gravelly, do be careful underfoot, it is undulating, you've got all loose rocks and things, um, so do be very careful. Uh, in terms of disabled access, I can't see any reason why you wouldn't be able to, again it is gravelly and things, but. There's no steps or anything like that. No reason why you wouldn't be able to push or have a wheelchair go around here. For the kids, absolutely amazing, I think. Yeah. If you, you, as I said earlier, if your kids love Christmas lights, things like that, well worth it. They've got some Easter themed things down there with the Easter eggs, educational. They've got the little show with the polar bear and the... Yeah, that's, that's good fun. Called? Panda, the so panda, it was really yeah. fun for the kids. They all have a good time there, so... Really I think for the price, one. you can spend as long as you want. I, I think it's, it's well worth the money, yeah. I would say, definitely. Um, so there you go, we finally came, finally did it. A lot of you recommended us to come and try it, and I would definitely recommend it, especially if you've got kids, yeah. especially. Some great picture opportunities, 100%. If you did enjoy the vlog, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Drop your comments as well, let me know your thoughts about it. Is it a good new addition to the south of Tenerife? Do let me know. Uh, do check out the channel, there's loads of content on there, uh, live streams, excursions, news updates, all kinds on there, so do check it out and consider subscribing. Uh, but from us, thank you very much for watching, stride on. I will of course as well leave the link to the incredible Wilson's channel uh, where Christy and Seb um, are featured, so I will leave that in the description. They've got a few vlogs coming from Tenerife, so uh, go and give them a thumbs up as well. And uh, thank you very much, stride on.